Hey everyone, Dr. Brent Thierry of Total Spine Health and Injury Center in Maple Grove. Now, when it comes to back pain relief, there's really no shortage of options from medication to physical therapy to chiropractic adjustments to acupuncture to injections to surgeries and even in new therapies like laser treatment, light therapy, and CBD oils. There's a ton of options to choose from. So, the real problem is not a lack of treatment options, but rather out of all of these options, which one do you choose? So as a chiropractor, and in my own life personally, I've seen just how effective chiropractic treatment can be in addressing things like back pain, neck pain, headaches, and sciatica. In fact, I'm convinced that it's, it's often the best treatment available for a number of these conditions. Now, as a chiropractor, it's no secret, and I'm probably biased towards chiropractic care, but in terms of effectiveness, cost, safety, and the additional benefits from treatment, that's where I believe that chiropractic really separates itself from the rest of the pack. Now, this isn't to say that there aren't valuable benefits to many of the treatment modalities out there, but if I was to choose a place to start when searching for pain relief, that's where I believe chiropractic is the best bet. So let's start with effectiveness. I mean, does chiropractic actually work? So there are roughly one million chiropractic adjustments performed each day across the globe. There's approximately 35 million Americans who are treated by a chiropractor annually. 77% of people who saw a chiropractor in the last year describe their care as very effective. In fact, chiropractors are often the highest rated healthcare practitioners for low back pain treatments. They're ranked above physical therapists, above specialty physicians like neurosurgeons, neurologists, and orthopedic surgeons, and actually above primary care physicians. Some studies have actually shown that some chiropractic techniques may actually be up to 40% more effective than medical care for treating lower back pain. And in a clinical trial, 94% of manual thrust manipulation recipients, so that's the adjustment, they experienced a 30% reduction in their pain compared with only 54% of medical care recipients. So chiropractic works. But what about the cost? I mean, isn't chiropractic expensive? Well, the real question is actually compared to what? So chronic pain costs the US $2,000 per year in healthcare costs per person on average, with 36 million Americans missing work each year. So in total, Americans spend at least $50 billion annually just on treating back pain. Now, when treatment for low back pain is initiated by a chiropractor, there's actually a 20% less cost than when it's started by a medical doctor. And by visiting a chiropractor regularly, you can reduce your pharmaceutical costs by up to 85%. And we see this again in research by the Journal of the American Board of Family Medicine. They found that replacing a visit to a doctor with a visit to a chiropractor for back pain could save Medicare $83.5 million per year. And that's some serious coin, right? So is chiropractic free? No, but it appears to be much more cost effective than many of the alternatives. So chiropractic works, it's cost effective, but is it ultimately safe? Now, chiropractic treatment is widely recognized as one of the safest forms of treatment for musculoskeletal conditions. The most common side effects, their stiffness and soreness following an adjustment with most symptoms usually subsiding within 24 hours. Now, there have been some reports that have associated high velocity manipulations of the cervical spine with vertebral artery dissection. However, evidence actually suggests that these events occurred spontaneously in patients with pre-existing artery disease. So in fact, the incidence of vertebral artery dissection is equal among those receiving adjustments and the general population. Now, what I believe is ultimately the big thing that separates chiropractic from all other treatment types is the other incredible benefit. So the focus on the spine has kind of created this perception that chiropractors are only back doctors and that the benefits of chiropractic extend really only to back pain relief. But what's amazing about chiropractic is the other benefits that accompany a properly functioning spine and a properly functioning nervous system as well. Individuals receiving regular spinal care they often note improved hormonal function, improved mobility, increased immune function, improved sleep, increased energy. And actually a study published in 2011 
evaluated the data from all the previous scientific literature and concluded that the best benefits achieved from chiropractic actually occur from proactive care, and that's over a period of time. So improving the health and the function of the spine positively influences the brain, the organs, the nerves, the bones, and the soft tissue. So chiropractic works, it's cost effective, it's safe, and there are other positive health benefits that often accompany chiropractic treatment. So when looking at many of the alternatives, it seems like chiropractic is a great place to start when looking to relieve your pain, but also to improve your health.